Injuries in sports are an accepted part of the game, but one injury in particular is seemingly on the rise and can have some serious long-term effects. Joining me now is athletic trainer Deb Jenks to talk about concussions. Thanks for being here. You're welcome. They, you know, you see it in the, in the news a lot more now. Have concussions been on the rise? Is there a lot more cases, do you feel? I think there's more uh, research that's been done about them and more education that's out there. So I think a lot were unreported before. Mm -hmm. I think that that's why we're seeing more of them out there because more kids and coaches are recognizing them. Mm -hmm. Parents are saying, oh, my kid has a concussion. I need to get him seen. Uh, they Statistically, there's over three million a year have been reported in the last year. Mm -hmm. So I think because of increased research that's being done and and more education that's out yeah. there, I think that's why we're seeing more of them. And on top of that, the sports are being played a lot have, harder, right. um, a lot more faster, bigger kids, <laughs> and. Um, I think we're, that's why we're seeing more of them. Yeah, there's definitely a lot more awareness about it. And we were talking about it in the break that it's not just boys playing football who are getting these concussions. Who, who else right. is this affecting? Well, I think there was actually just a recent um, show on uh, Rock Center that mm -hmm. s studied and looked at soccer players, girls soccer players with concussions, and the use of these headbands and you know all of this stuff, and that kids just don't want to come out of this, their right. sport. And we're seeing the long-term effects of that. And we're seeing more in females. And um, females actually are more prone to them mm -hmm. than guys for you know, m different reasons. But that's what we're, we're seeing mm -hmm. in, in across the board, men and women's sports. So what, what can coaches and parents do to kind of protect the kids out there on the field? Well, I think educating yourself as a parent and coach and an athlete is really important. Um, there is recent legislation that was just passed by Governor Walker, mm -hmm. um, an actual concussion bill per se, um, which is going to affect us coming into this sports season. And basically it's saying that ed you're going to have to educate yourself as a coach, a parent, and an athlete. You're going to have to sign a piece of paper saying that you understand what a concussion is, the signs and symptoms. Right. Uh, those signs and symptoms um, kind of off off the that most people need to know are you know looking for headaches seeing if your kid is confused or dazed and, and there's gonna there's, you have a free wellness class on all of this tomorrow night right correct um, Dr. Uh, Deanne Eccles mm -hmm. is doing a free wellness class tomorrow night okay. in Stoughton at the Bryant Wellness Center okay um, in 6 30 right 6 30 p.m. okay and that's free to the public and people can come and educate themselves more perfect all and right well, thank you so much for You're being welcome. on our program You're today. Welcome. We appreciate it. You're welcome. Okay.